Johto! Man, what's good with y'all? It's your boy, not out of soul, not out of chosen one, not out of glow. I'm back with another video. Shout out to all the new subscribers. Woo! 100 days plus. We still going strong in this thing. <laughs> Let's go. If you still going strong, say, nah, nah, I'm going strong. And some fire emojis. You guys know that's my favorite emoji. It just hypes me up. When I see fire emojis in my comment section, it hypes me up. It gets me started. It gets me going. Woo! We got that glow. Hey, yeah. We got that seed. Hey, yeah. We got that glow. Hey, yeah. We got that seed. Hey, yeah. Man, let's go. Fellas, listen up. Okay? It's actually snowing right now. Like, man, you guys know what time it is, bro. You know, it's, it's a cold, it's cold weather time. It's snowing. You guys know there's a lot of women out here now who, who you know, they're, they're, they want to cuddle, right? Fellas, you probably want to cuddle. You cold. <laughs> but we got to stay strong. We got to keep this seed because believe it or not, when you hold on to this seed, you actually stay warm. I ain't gonna lie. You stay warm, bro. You don't get sick, right? This cold weather, a lot of people tend to get sick. When you bust the nuts all the time, you're going to be getting sick a lot. But us retainers, we barely get sick even, even in this cold, okay? But I want to talk to you guys about accountability and how you must hold yourself accountable. Hold on, y'all. Notifications off every time I have to remember because people be calling me, texting me. Like, I, I'm, I'm trying to focus right now. Accountability on semen retention. Accountability on NoFap. You know, I feel like a lot of men do not hold themselves accountable, okay? as You as a man, you must hold yourself accountable for all your actions right i'm 19 years old okay and i'm i'm inspiring people older than me i'm inspiring people younger than me to hold themselves accountable for their actions and their their you know their mistakes fellas let's say you relapse okay you must hold yourself accountable for that nobody made you relapse okay you made that decision to relapse hold yourself accountable Okay, a lot of people in our society don't want to do this. A lot of people don't want to, you know, take the blame if it's really them. They don't hold themselves accountable when it's really them who did it. A lot of people lie about it. A lot of people, a lot of people will lie. A lot of people are like, oh, it wasn't me. Hold yourself accountable, fellas. Okay, this is some. This is a great trait to have as a man. You know, just being able to, you know, right your wrongs. Okay. You being able to not lie about things that you did and you, you know you made a mistake. Just say it was you. Just say, man, look, right? I hold myself accountable. I made a mistake and I'm going to do better, right? Surprise, bro, believe it or not, you know, surprisingly, people actually, you know, view you as a leader. People view you and respect you when you, when you hold yourself accountable. Women will respect you. Other men will respect you when you hold yourself accountable. Okay. People will just be like, wow, this guy is mature. Holding yourself accountable makes you mature. You know, a lot of people who are not mature, they're just going to lie about it. They're going to be like, man, look, you know, they, something, they caused me to do this. Somebody caused me to do that. Right. They don't hold themselves accountable. They don't say, hey, it was me. This is something you guys have to start realizing, man. A relapse, right. It's not. Of course, the temptation, the urges, but fellas, you got to understand the bigger picture. Honestly, if we're being logical as men, it was your fault, right? A re bro, all my relapses, it was my fault. I indulged into the urge. I indulged into temptation, right? Of course, you can always not do it, but when you do it, it is your fault. And I had to come to the realization that I have to hold myself accountable for my mistakes. Always. This makes me learn even more about myself. This makes me mature mentally about myself. You guys have to pick this trade up, man. It's going to help you in your life. You know, people will respect you when you hold yourself accountable. You know, women especially, obviously, they like a man who can hold themselves accountable. They like a man, right, who can say, hey, I know I made a mistake, but I'm sorry. Okay? It's just facts. Facts, fellas. Hold yourselves accountable, man. We're on a journey of self-improvement. We're on a journey to better our lives, bro.
refreshing, man. You guys know I had to get my water in real quick. We're on a journey of self-improvement. We're on a journey to, you know, get these gains in the gym. We're on, the, on this journey to build our purpose and kingdom as men, to get more finances, okay? Just to become the better versions of ourselves as possible. This is what self-improvement is, okay? And you, if you are on self-improvement, holding yourself accountable will help you. You're gonna, you're gonna learn on your journey that if you don't hold yourself accountable, you're always gonna look to look look at someone and blame them for your for your mistakes when it was really you. <laughs> Never blame people for your mistakes. I'm telling y'all, bro. I'm telling you. I remember I used to do this back in the day when somebody, quote unquote, you know, when I used to mess up, make a mistake, I'm like, man, look, they did it. They made me do it. <laughs> <laughs> I used to put the blame on people. I'm telling you, I don't do that, bro. Hold yourself accountable, right? We're on self-improvement, fellas. We kings out here retaining our seed. We kings out here disciplining our urges, right? Taming our urges. I was at the gym earlier this morning, and man, I looked at myself in the mirror, and I can see the fire in my eyes. <laughs> I can see the fire in my eyes. And I know people around me, right, can see it as well. Because the way people look at you when you're at the gym, it's like they see another being. They see somebody who's so different. You are different, right? You at the gym focused. You know, normally when you're at the gym, you see a lot of people just looking for attention. Everybody's looking around for, for who's looking at who. I'm like, what is wrong with you people? Focus on your workouts. <laughs> you guys, bro, let me know if you guys notice this. At the gym, people are always looking for attention. It's so sad, bro. Why do you go to the gym? Just to get attention? Go to the gym to work on yourself. That was, that's what it's for, right? To get your gains in and get out. That's it. Why are we in the gym? Everybody just staring at each other. I'm like, bro, what, what do y'all want? <laughs> what do y'all honestly want? It gets to the point where I don't, me personally, when I hit the gym, I don't purposely ignore people. I'm just worried about hitting my weights, getting my reps in, and getting out the gym. That's it. Okay, I have my headphones in, bumping my music, I'm feeling myself, I'm getting my, my, my reps in, and everybody's just looking at me like I, I'm, I'm doing something wrong. It's because you're, not, you're, the, you're, the, you're that person who's not looking for attention. You're focused, and everybody's wondering, who are you? Because everybody else is looking for attention, but you, just this one person, which is you on re, re, SEMA retention and on NoFap, you are not. <laughs> <laughs> you are not looking for attention. You are actually focused on your workouts. People don't understand this, man. Our society, bro, our generation needs a lot of help, y'all. Okay, it needs a lot of help. So if you guys have knowledge about semen retention, if you have knowledge about self-improvement, if you have knowledge about how this world can become a better place, you better start making content. Okay, I don't care if you get inspired by me. That's a great thing. I love it when you guys get inspired by me, right? And start doing videos. I love it, bro. It makes me happy. It makes me, you know, clap it up for y'all, bro. I'm like, yes, sir. Right? I'm like, yes, sir. You guys are doing the right thing. I'm doing the right thing. Let's keep retaining this seed, bro. But I was, as I was saying, I could see the fire in my eyes when I was at the gym, right? I was sweating like crazy. I was looking at myself. I'm like, bro, I am killing these weights. <laughs> these weights are probably crying. <laughs> bro, I was killing them weights, boy. Like, I was just, bro, I was, when I, bro, it's something about it, bro. You just become so powerful. You feel powerful when you're at the gym, bro. When you let in this energy, you know, when you're transmuting it into something good, you just feel so good, bro. Like just hitting it. Bro. I'm telling you, it's something about the gym. It hits too different on Seymour retention. When I used to relapse and I hit the gym, it, it didn't hit. It hit, but it didn't hit as much as now when I'm holding on to something, bro. It it it, it hits on a whole different level. <laughs> nah, 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 so let's go. I hope you guys are hyped, bro. We have one more month left on this journey bro let's keep retaining bro one more month left of this year not uh, did i say journey not not the journey i mean of this year if i said journey my fault i'm talking about this year we have one more month left of this year and we're going into 2023 okay i'm gonna make a separate video before we get into 2023 so that everybody who's watching me 
I'm, I'm making a separate video and tell y'all to put y'all goals for 2023 in the comment section. And we're gonna see at the end of 2023, who's gonna accomplish those goals. You're gonna come back and look at your uh, my video right from, from, from 2022, December, when I make the video, and you're gonna see at the end of 2023 if you accomplished your goals. Me too, I'm gonna do the same thing. All right, we're gonna see if we accomplish our goals, y'all. This is something that is very important. You know, I think journaling is something good too to take accountability for. When you are journaling, it helps you take accountability for your, for your actions, for your mistakes, right? For things that you said you're gonna do. Be accountable for that, fellas. If you said you're gonna do something, be accountable, you're a man, do it, okay? You said you're gonna hit the gym at 5 a.m., wake up in the morning, go hit that gym. You said you're going to cut down on, you know, processed foods, cut down on fast foods. Do it. Hold yourself accountable. You said you're going to stop chasing women and focus on God and focus on your purpose. Stop doing it. Focus on God. Get on your purpose. I'm telling y'all, bro, we must hold ourselves accountable. Do it, fellas. It's going to help your life grow. It's going to help you become more of a man, right? You're going to be mature, right? This makes you attractive to everybody. Wow, you know, being attractive to people, of course everybody wants to be attracted to everybody, okay? So that's something that you can do, holding yourself accountable, okay? Being organized. I'm not saying you have to be perfect. I'm not perfect, but I make sure I hold myself accountable. I make sure I plan out things the right way, and I make sure I accomplish what I said I'm going to accomplish. I hold myself accountable. I said I'm going to hit a year on semen retention. I'm going to hold myself accountable. I ain't busting no nuts, that's, that's something I'm, I'm holding myself accountable for. You should too. Whatever goals you have, hold yourself accountable. I know somebody needs this video. You've been slacking. Get off of your butt. Listen to me. Listen to none of the soul. Get off of your butt, right? You're not going to be in the best shape of your life sitting on the couch eating Doritos and Cheetos. Never. Get off your butt, right? I'm not going to curse. I'm not. Get off your butt. Go to the gym every single day stay consistent and then you will see the results you sitting down watching uh, uh, eating cheetos and playing and playing call of duty right <laughs> not gonna give you the gains my brother you're not gonna get no gains doing that you're not okay you sitting there on tinder swiping left and right <laughs> you sitting there swiping left and right for women's attention right it's not gonna get you the woman of your dreams you sitting there watching pornography right? It's not going to better your life. You are not going to be successful. You're not going to be powerful jizzing all over yourself through pornography. Fellas, wake up. Get on the grind now. Start improving your life now. Start holding yourself accountable now. This is no game, bro. This is how I'm feeling. Yes, I'm feeling good, right? I'm feeling manly once again. I'm feeling very confident. Not cocky. There's two different, that's two different things. Confident and cocky, right? I'm feeling very confident. I'm feeling very sure of myself. I know what I want out of this world and I'm going to go get it. Okay? This is me holding myself accountable. This is me taking action. You must learn how to do that. I don't care how old you are. If you say you're going to accomplish something, do it, fellas. Stop letting family hold you back. Stop letting women hold you back. Stop letting... Uh, 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 your friends hold you back Associates, strangers right? Stop letting people hold you back Go do what you said you gonna do Real talk I said I was gonna make a YouTube channel When I was a, when I, when I was a child right? I said I was gonna do these things And I still stand on it I told you guys I'm gonna hit 100k subscribers I'm gonna make sure I grind To the day I hit 100k subscribers I don't care how long it takes me <laughs> I just don't care I will grind, God will work Right when I when when I move, God will help me. You know my channel grow. That He just waits on me. Okay, everything happens for a reason, y'all. This video is not a mistake for somebody who's needing it. Okay, it's gonna pop up at the right time. Rec it's gonna pop. My videos have actually been going on recommended. I really appreciate you guys. Comment down below and leave a like and subscribe to my channel. By the way, join my Discord server. I will put another link in the description and in the comment section. I will pin it in the uh, comment section. Uh, follow my Instagram with not out of soul with two L's, right? And everything else will be in the description. I have a lot of links in my description. Just go over them and look look at what links you know you're interested in and click on it. Simple. I'm on the grind. You know, I ain't never gonna stop till I hit the top. <laughs> I ain't never gonna stop till I hit the top. I ain't never gonna stop till I hit the top. Yo, let's get it, man. 
I love you guys, man. I hope this video did something to you. I hope it inspired you to get off your butt, right? Get off of the game. Yes, get off of the PS4, get off of the PS5, get off the Xbox 360, get off the Xbox One, get off the Xbox One S. I don't know if that's a console, but whatever, right? Get off all these gaming systems. I'm not saying you can never play games, but fellas, if you listen, this is about before I end the video, listen to me. If you know you are somewhere in life that you don't like, you have, you know for a fact you are not where you want to be. Oh man, you got to grind. <laughs> Get up, go grind. Nothing's just gonna be handed to you as a man. You gotta get up and go get it. This YouTube channel I built, this kink, this 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 business I built, I didn't just sit there and this was handed to me. Hell no. <laughs> Hell no. I had to grind my butt off and I'm still grinding to this day. It ain't never gonna stop if you are a man. The grind will never stop. Also, if you're a child of God, we can never stop, right? We can never stop because we are destined for greatness simple i love you guys right like the video let's keep retaining this seed let's keep being men i'm out Woo!